Hello there, how are you? It's Diane Banks, voice actress, radio personality, and Disney fan like you. I hope you'll subscribe. Just click on the red button and check out my other videos too. My latest is Olaf, Once Upon a Snowman, Easter Eggs. You can see Oaken in there too. So check that out and yes, please subscribe. We're going to talk about Soul today. Uh, some beautiful concept art and I've got some comparisons for you from other Disney movies and also from the finished product itself. Um, but it's on December 25th. Very excited. Going to go right to Disney Plus, which some people aren't that happy about. But I think with COVID and everything, it's probably a really good idea to not go for the theaters right now. So let me know your thoughts on that. But here is some of the concept art. Now, unfortunately, they did not tell us the artist's names. I always love to know who the artists are. I bet you do, too. But um, at least we get to enjoy the concept art anyway. Uh, but some of these, I thought, look similar to other Disney films. Of course, they have influences. This one reminded me of 101 Dalmatians. Oops, where'd I go? There we go. Um, just the style. Let me know your thoughts on that, too. But that's what I thought. It looks kind of like that. Kind of moody and foggy and beautiful. Uh, and then... These guys, there's all these, these look like little Q-tips to me. Um, and then, you know, we'll understand better once we see the movie. But I love this. Like, the musical notes are kind of abstract. Isn't that beautiful? Um, this one, too, reminds me of 101 Dalmatians concept art. What do you think? Kind of, right? Um, in his work studio there is playing his music at home. I guess he's a teacher and wants to be a jazz musician and then he falls down a manhole and things change and it's from the peeps who brought us inside out but um let's see i got a comparison here well i wanted to show you this close up too just because um i think it's gorgeous um and i hope you like it too but this one uh, just so you can compare to this so i thought i'd do this on a, just on a few of these but don't you think there's a definite feel like the energy is kind of the same the style so I thought that was kind of neat uh, okay we're gonna go back here there's some more beautiful art there's a like a black and white study couple like that uh, this one reminded me of Fantasia a little bit what do you think kind of a little bit of influence there that's very inside out isn't it uh, Let's see. <laughs> Isn't it? Yeah, very. And it's the same team, so you would think that they might have a similarity in concept. That reminds me of one of those Pixar shorts. I think it was a, about education or something. I'd have to go back and look. But this one, um, there's a kind of a pic, uh, Picasso-type character, which I'm sure we'll get to know better in the movie, that I'll show you uh, the finished art for that in a minute. But this one, let's go take a peek at how the finished product looks for this one. Um, so here you can see it's kind of similar, right? This um, saxophone player in the middle, her costume is a little bit different, or her outfit for work, and then the bass player, I love their look, um, and she's just kind of like on the opposite side of the room as they have her in the concept. But I thought this was kind of interesting. They have a drummer here, and in the movie, we don't see a drummer in this scene. At least in this scene, we don't. But we do have, look who's on the piano. Uh, it's Jamie Foxx. <laughs> That's his character. I don't actually know what his character's name is, but he's there. But I thought it was kind of neat. So there we see from concept to movie what that ended up looking like. Um, and there's that. I'll show you that in a second, the Picasso kind of character. But I thought this one... Um, came out looking pretty much like they did in the concept. What do you think? I think that's pretty close. We'll go over here so you can see it better. Don't you think? From concept to finish, pretty close. Pretty cute, too. And that Picasso kind of character must play a big part in this. What do you think? And then here's some more lovely concepts. Oh, I love the kitty in this movie. I can't wait to meet him or her, whichever. But here's... Well, I'll just make it bigger here for you, so you can see the, the kitty cat. Here's a few scenes. Look how cute. That looks like maybe that's right before they fall down the manhole cover. or what, There's the Picasso kind of character. Like, I don't know what that what happens there, but right? It looks like he or she has a kind of a big role, or at least they're big in the scene. 
so that's what that looks like. Um, oh yeah, and there's the Kit Kat again. Look at how cute! Oh, I'm gonna want a stuffed animal. I think of that cute kitty cat. And then there's Kitty at the barber shop. Ah, oh, so cute! And I think, tell me if you agree that I think the concept Kitty looks very much like the Kitty in the movie. Sometimes the concept's very different, but this Kit Kat looks pretty much the same and and I love it don't you I love the style so cute uh, outside a pizza place some nice more black and white uh, let's see there's a few more okay in this one let's take a look at what he looks like from his concept to finish we kind of went by him a minute ago there he is oops so what do you think I actually kind of like him in concept better than what he ended up looking like but that's just me um, and I'll share your thoughts. There's Kitty. So they meet, I guess, before he falls down the manhole. But yeah, I don't know. But you know, I love 2D animation. I could watch all of these movies in 2D. I wish they would make them all in 2D as well as 3. <laughs> because I just love it so much. But oh, there's that neat character again, the bass player. And we don't know yet what her role is. Maybe his wife? Hmm. We don't know. I love this. Don't you? I love the abstract nature. I love the color choice. Oh, it's just super neat, and I wish I knew who the artist was because that's really cool. Okay, so that goes back around there. And then here, I also wanted to share with you um, something they mentioned about D23. I don't know if any of you guys subscribe to the D23 magazine. I actually don't, but you can get it at their website. And if you're a gold member, I believe, of D23, I'm like a, just a regular member where it's free. And you can be a free member there, and they still have a lot of fun stuff too. But if you want to do the gold membership, you'll get their quarterly magazine. And there's a lot of cool stuff in there, I guess. And then this beautiful concept art they chose for the cover of the winter 2020 D23 magazine. So isn't that beautiful? I love the artwork there. So that's just a heads up. If it's something you want to subscribe to, maybe get this as a collector piece. Um, I don't think it's that expensive to be a gold member. I'm not sure, but you can find that at you know D23.com, their D23 website. I love this. So there's a nice cool moment from the movie. And I think we saw the rest of these. So um, I just wanted to share all that beautiful concept art with you. Can't wait for the movie. Let me know if you're excited about it too. I'm not upset that it's going to Disney Plus and we get it right away, but I guess some of the international markets were not so super happy about that. Um, as we wrap up here though, I just wanted to share this with you since um, Inside Out is kind of the sister movie to Soul, that this was cute. They released this for Christmas, a little Core Memories photo card you can make at home and I'll um, give you the links for this so you can do this but basically they show you here and then they have more directions I'll include this link too but um, it shows how you know I don't know who this family is but it's just to show you how you can make into a little Christmas card for yourself or send to friends um, a cute little photo card with our friends from inside out super cute so I hope you enjoyed looking at some of this beautiful concept art this is for 101 Dalmatians you can always take a peek at my Instagram for more art uh, it's all about Disney on my Instagram, that's for sure. <laughs> um, but let me know your thoughts. Like I said, are you excited about the movie? Do you like the concept art? Anything Disney you want to talk about, please come by and say hi. It's Diane Banks. Thanks again for watching. Please subscribe, that little red button, and we'll talk soon. Stay safe.